Welcome to your weekly drone news update, and this is week 54. And this week I want to talk about four different topics. The first one is DJI Airworks is going to be moved online. The next one is a company that is doing medical drone delivery, and we'll talk a little bit more about those details. Uh, I also want to talk about AirMap. Their headquarters actually burned to the ground, and I want to talk about this and show you some pictures. And then lastly, I want to talk about a new course with Pilot Institute, and it's actually a brand new uh, free course. Free is good, right? So. Let's get to it. And the first thing this week is DJI announced that they will be having their conference, their annual conference called Airworks, and that's going to be held online. The conference is going to be held on uh, August 25th to August 28th. And this is a really great place if you want to learn anything about the commercial world, the commercial field. They have a lot of different uh, speakers about a lot of different topics. And the good news is it's actually really cheap. Now, I talked about this a couple of weeks ago. The FAA has a conference going on with AUVSI and it decided to charge an arm and a leg, unfortunately. And I think a lot of people are just going to pass on this. There's actually a lot of chatter online about this. So uh, DJI, I think, kind of learned from this and they said that this was going to be only $35 if you register on Monday, this upcoming Monday. You have one day to register for $35. After this, it's going to be $49 until June 9th. And after June 9th, it's going to be $99. Even at $99, it actually beats the price. The, the actual price to get in in person to this, if it wasn't held online, is about $750. So saving quite a bit of money. Uh, you don't have to attend all of the days and actually with your login, you can go back and watch the videos uh, for a period of one year. So that's pretty cool. So I have a link down there and I'm going to set a reminder in my calendar to go on Monday and register because this is a really good deal for 35 bucks. The next thing I want to talk about is this company called Zipline. Now I've talked about Zipline last year because they were doing a lot of first with their drone delivery. Uh, they've been pretty busy in Africa actually and, uh, and now they're doing drone delivery medical drone delivery that is in the US. And uh, they will be delivering actually hospital supplies such as the, the PPE uh, equipment, the, the personal protective equipment, up to 32 miles from their uh, starting facility. This is happening in Charlotte, North Carolina, and they're using a fixed wing airplane. You can see the picture right here of what is going on with this. And it has a catapult to get it started, which is fairly common. And then they have a parachute to drop the supply all the way down to the ground. So I'm gonna put a link down here to the article from Drone Life, and then you can find more information about it if you want, but I thought this was pretty cool. And this is something that we need at the moment to provide supplies to all of our uh, healthcare workers. The next thing is a little bit of a sad news. Um, I don't always agree with AirMap. I've, I've talked about AirMap in the past and I don't always agree with their policies, but this is kind of heartbreaking. Their uh, headquarters were actually burned in uh, Santa Monica, California during one of the riots. And, uh, and their co-founder, Greg McNeil, he posted information on his Twitter account and you can see the pictures right here. And uh, they basically lost everything in that, in that uh, office right there. So this is something sad. Uh, it doesn't matter how you feel about AirMap, quite frankly, but this is, this is something that should not happen to anyone. And uh, kind of sad, I hope they, they rebuild and I hope they, they get uh, to, hopefully they didn't lose anything. And that's one reminder, by the way, for anyone that this is riot related, but fires can happen anywhere. Uh, if you have data, make sure that everything is backed up somewhere safe in the cloud if possible, so you have access to it. So. Uh, Wish you guys the best and hopefully you can recover from this and, uh, and move forward. The last thing I want to talk about this week is a free course that we released actually last week. It was on Friday, uh, right after I released this uh, video, this news video, but we have a free Mavic Air 2, we call it a deep dive course. And this course is three hours long and it's going to walk you through all the steps to learn about the Mavic Air 2. Uh, as you know, I've tested the Mavic Air 2. I had a pre-release model. I was able to go and, and do some, uh, some reviews of it. And what I did is I took the entire thing. I took the, the manual, the paper manual, and I made a course out of it. And it's free. It's available out there. If you're a student already, very simple. One click, you can get in and you can follow all the steps. I go over basically every single flight modes in there and I show you examples of how to set them up. Uh, there's a lot of intelligent flight modes in there. I go over all the different settings and actually I have a few more videos that I'm going to add very soon. And uh, as DJI starts to update things, then I'll also update the course. So you can find more information on pilotinstitute.com along with all the other courses that we offer. 
And um, this is all I have for this week. So as always, if you haven't done so, please subscribe. We're growing really fast and adding more and more subscribers every week. Um, you also will notice that I've been posting, we've been posting more FPV videos from Don. Uh, Don is our FPV instructor. Uh, Don is an incredible pilot with his uh, FPV drone. And, uh, and he's been collecting footage for us and we've been putting these videos out. So uh, keep an eye on them. I, I think they're really impressive. And Don teaches our course on how to create an FPV drone from scratch. And so he has all the parts, he shows you all the different steps to do this. And then, then you get your own drone, own cinematic drone, and you can do stuff like he does. So uh, after several years of practice for sure. But uh, so this is all I have. I will see you guys next week and you have a great weekend and safe flying.